favourite here. But even things have changed, uh, even with Blake around. But things have changed uh, slightly for the past couple of seasons. A Safa's start hasn't looked that great at all. It hasn't been consistent, we have to say. Oh, he's been pushing the block. In the set position now. And away they go. Clean start by Blake. Ashmead is in there as well. Asafa Powell has some running to do. Now he begins to come forward on the outside. Johan Blake gets the job done in fine style. 9.96 seconds for Johan Blake. That was a brilliant run. Asafa Powell was in there from minor share. So too, Nikhil Ashmead. But Johan Blake at 9.95 seconds has laid down the gauntlet somewhat in this second semi-final. Ashmead second in 10.01. Powell is third in 10.02. And Bailey Cole fourth in 10.04. Oh, that was a fantastic race. Uh, I did not see Johan get out particularly well. He seemed to be very rocky at the start, but his transition was fantastic. I mean, he made up a lot of ground there and surged to the front of the, of the field with Everton Clark on the inside looking to be holding on very well, but it seems like Nicole Ashmead and um, Asafa came through on the last couple of steps, maybe the last 10 meters just to pass him. As you see here, Johan not really, Everton Clark seemed to have gotten the best start of all. Johan gets up and is getting into his running. You see Asafa starting to make some room on the outside, making a run towards the front. Nickel looks like he's in trouble, but seems to have that 200 meter strength and comes through at the end seem to be taking the second position. So it's Blake 995, Ashmead second 1001, and Asafa Powell in third 1002. Blake shot it down with about five meters to go. And I tell you something, he has something left in that tank of his. Has a bit of fuel left for the final this evening. So Blake 995, Ashmead 1001, Powell 1002, Bailey Cole 1004, Livermore 1007, 